All right, so here we have the Ventura portable DJ booth and lighting bar system. We're gonna unbox it and we're gonna show you how to put it together. All right, now that we've got everything unboxed, we can start putting it together. It's gonna to require a little bit of assembly the first time you put it together. Uh, from there, it'll fit in the bags nicely. So let's start doing that. The first thing you need is your manual, of course. Uh, we have a nice little instruction manual if you have any questions in addition to this video. So first thing we're gonna do is open up our hardware bag. You've got a couple different hex keys here that you'll need. Um, while you're assembling this the first time. So the first thing we're gonna do is take the horizontal support bars and uh, those are used to support the countertop as well as the lighting bar. So this step is gonna require some short bolts, which are right here. Uh, so you're gonna need four of these as well as the smaller of the two hex keys. And let's attach this. Now when you're assembling these, make sure that the three holes are on top. All right, now that we have the horizontal support bars attached, we need to attach a vertical support bar, which is going to support the lighting bar. So this, you're gonna need uh, the larger of the two hex keys. The bolt is already uh, bolted into here, so you're gonna have to take it out first. Okay, and we're also gonna need two more of the short bolts uh, and this is using the smaller hex key all right now we've got the support bars attached let's open it up and we're going to set up the countertop at this point uh, we could put the scrims on but for the purposes of this video we're going to wait till the end so that you guys can see what's going on back here. All right, so support bars, crossbars. So we've got four wing bolts here that I use to secure the crossbar. So once you've adjusted your angle to your liking, you can go ahead and secure these in place. All right, so now we've got the crossbars on, we need to apply some Velcro to keep the countertop in place. All right, so we've got the uh, horizontal support bars, we've got the crossbars, now we can put on the countertop. So this countertop uh, comes in two sections. And the reason for this, again, is because the uh, sides are expendable. So you can choose to have your countertop in the middle, or possibly you could have a little gap in the middle if you want to extend it out further. So for here, we're just going to start right at the middle. So I'm just kind of aiming right in between the two um, center sections of the frame and just laying it down right here. In case you guys were wondering how much weight this can hold, do not try this at home, but just to show you that this thing is really sturdy, I weigh close to 200 pounds. So there you go. Okay, and these are secured on with the, with the Velcro. Um, and as you add more weight from the equipment, everything is gonna stabilize even more. So the booth is pretty much set up. Uh, again, we could put the scrims on at any time. We're gonna wait till the end so that you guys have a clear view on what's going on here. So the booth is done. We're gonna start uh, putting together the lighting bar. So the first thing is to grab these guys. These are the attachments for the lighting bar and they go right in here. Loosen up your wing bolts and just attach these right here. 
So the last step is gonna be to attach the lighting bar. There's uh, five pieces to the lighting bar. You've got the two legs, uh, the two main sections, and a center section. So the first thing I'm gonna do is attach one of the center section to each leg. Okay, and we're gonna do this. And again, you'll notice the bolt is uh, kind of uh, built in here so it doesn't uh, come out. You don't lose it or don't misplace it. Okay, then we can attach this to the booth. Same thing on the other side. And uh, there's uh, the nut here, which is preventing the bolt from escaping. You can adjust this as needed so it can just fit right inside the bar there. Okay. All right, last piece of the lighting bar is this center piece here that attaches the two goalposts. Now, this piece is optional. You could very well use this, uh, this lighting bar as two independent T-bars. You know, you can angle these any way that you want. Uh, but for the purposes of this video, we're gonna go ahead and insert this. Uh, this may look a little wobbly to you right now, but that's because I haven't tightened everything up yet. So, uh, finally, uh, last two wing bolts that are gonna secure this centerpiece in place. And uh, there's mounting holes all along this bar, and you have a mounting hole right here in the center, so I like to make sure this is right in the center before I tighten everything up. All right, you're ready to hang some lights. Um, as I mentioned, there are several uh, mounting points throughout the lighting bar, seven to be precise, and you've got the mounting hardware in the box, uh, so it's just bolt, washer, wing nut, and you just set that up with each light. If you prefer to use uh, clamps and brackets, you can do that as well. Um, as this is a, a tube, it'll fit one inch clamps. So once you've hung your lights, now you're ready to raise the lighting bar. For this, you might wanna ask for a little help from your friends. So, like I mentioned before, we waited till the end to put the scrims on, but you can really be doing this earlier in the process. It's actually probably the first thing that you could do before you even put the support bars or anything else, so you don't have to work around them when you're putting the scrims on. <clears throat> the only reason you might ever need to take the scrims off is to wash them. Uh, so the rest of the time, I mean, you can leave them on when you pack it up in the bag, and we'll show you later on in the video. So let's go ahead and put these on. All right, so there you have it. The Headliner Ventura Portable DJ Booth and Lighting Bar System. Let's accessorize. Oh, that's better. All right, so the gig's over. It's time to pack up. We've included a set of carry bags with the uh, Ventura DJ Booth. The first bag is for uh, the lighting bar and all the poles and the second bag is for the facade. 